Hi Aries, my name's Sophia, welcome to this community. So what I was picking up was Seven of Cups. This is about choices um, and I feel that still, I'll just be honest, making the wrong choice. See, the thing with Seven of Cups is like, it's like the cup. So you feel you're getting emotionally fulfilled from what you're doing. But the Seven of Cups is there's seven choices. They're not all the same as the Ace of Cups. But I feel with you, you're like, okay, I'm going to do this. This will lead to my Ace of Cups. So you're going towards one of the cups and seeing it as an Ace. Ace of Cups. If that makes sense. But it's like, no, it's Seven of Cups. This is, this is uh, options. This is delusion. You want to focus on the one. And I feel each of these different examples you go to give you a little bit. This is why you keep moving around to these other options, different things. But you've had an experience of the Ace of Cups for you to even listen to this reading. And that's your person. But you're saying they're delusional, they're drugged up, they're in the, in the, uh, uh, their head in the clouds. But it's you. They show you a mirror. You're delusional, bunny hopping. You might be even trying other choices. They are with someone else. You're with someone else, right? Because they are with someone else. It's never. It's not that. I like I say. It depends if you're new. I don't even. Know, I don't even know if my person was with someone else. There was rumors he was with someone else, right? I didn't care to know. I knew I was a twin flame, and I know what I'm supposed to do. And you know as well. You keep going round and off course. And what takes you off is because your person's not showing up as that ace of cup. So you're choosing all these other cups, right? It has to be at the seven because eight of cups is completely walking away. I don't think you're sitting at home just chewing gum, watching telly all day. I feel you're doing things, all these choices, but it's not the ace of cups. You need to get to being nine of cups right which is walking away is next is eight from the things that don't serve you and that's hard to do and that's walking away from you thinking a way of you doing it is just doing bit here bit here bit there there's a massive delusion here in this seven of cups i'm seeing because you're convincing yourself which is self-sabotage it's worse than when you think so you know, an alcoholic, you know, you, the mum wants to drag her son to AA to get sorted. And it's that kind of thing as when they see it. When are you going to see it? I don't know. But this is about you seeing that you're doing it wrong. They've given you a twin flame and you're making all these other options to say they're not. Even if it's good or bad and they're not supposed to be with me now. It's divine time when they're ready. This is silliness. You're supposed to, you know what you're supposed to do. Why aren't you choosing to do it? This is connected to, with my uh, reading today. That's the energy. I can guarantee you if I went to a tower reading who's done astrology, there's something about choices. Making the correct choice. You choose something like that. That's what I'm picking up today. There's some kind of something or whatever with the astrology. So let's see how this is connected to you and your person, which I know why it is. But your choice in love. There's something about sticking to it as well. Your person doesn't stick with you because you don't stick to things. It's like as if you want that it's like you're literally the good and the bad of uh, the Aries reading. The Aries connecting to the false card. The fool jumps into the unknown. So you're trying things, but then you quit. That's the bad part of the Aries is quitting too soon. Jumping in, getting out, and then, oh, this is for me. I'll try something else. Going out, rushing out, jumping in, oh, then it isn't for me. That's the negative. You're on the negative side of this. But it can be transmuted and moved on. Two of Wands is trying to get you onto your right path. Because you keep making these other options. That's what he's saying. Getting you onto the right path. Page of Cups is like you've turned your back on your person. You might turn around if they come with an offer. Page of Cups, right? 
Oh, I'm going, you, this is what I'm saying. I think you think you're doing it. What you're doing, is it anything that is connected with what I say, my version of mission? Galactic in the slightest, alien in the slightest, no. It might be tarot, might be crystals, might be counselling. Is it anything that when I go deep into the galactic, galactic school transmissions, whatever's, not my guides, don't go with Angelica, my guides, right? Everyone can do that, soulmates included, right? This is connected with, you're just going ahead passionately with, and the other one is holding your world and thinking you're wisely doing it. But you've totally turned your back because this one is leading this way to why you're here. It's like, yeah, I'm a twin flame, so I'm going to go over there and do tarot, <laughs> right? And I'm like, these are my beginner cards. You're a beginner. Stop acting like you're wise and you know what you're doing. You're a beginner. You need to turn around, right, and face it. Your person's a beginner, and so this is you acting wise, and your person coming in as a page, as they truly are, you need to know your page, and start this shit over, and stick to it, a page is a student, you got to finish the student stuff, right, the chariot, as within, so without, so what is it that makes you keep bunny hopping in and out, I wonder, I'll see if I get into that, because this isn't moving forward with the chariot because of you, two of wands because you're not on the correct path so obviously if you're going that way your person's down this road right you're not going to meet up this is what's going on in this reading three of wands is yep look three of wands is you've released your person underneath you here thinking you're wise i'm going to do my own thing sophia i've got to passionately go towards my own thing i'm grabbing the the world in my hand right but you're going in that way or turns your back on your person it doesn't mean like literally fuck off cunty, although this is my fuck off cunty card because look, she looks pissed off. It's more about, look, there's nothing happening there. You're waiting. Three of Wands is waiting, waiting for the ships to come in. I'm waiting so it's not happening so I'm going to do what I've got to do. But no, you're supposed to do it this way and face the situation. You don't have to literally, I say, I didn't know, I, 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 I think the first two, three years I was with David, and I didn't know where the guy lived. I never went. I never saw the door. If anyone said you, you even went to his door. No. I don't know what colour his door is. I never knew where he lived. That's trust. You're not. Because your person's not there. Coming with a, you know, a proposal or something. Right. Apology. Or, or, of love. You're like. I'm tired of waiting. I'm going to do something else. That shit needs to crumble right you that your way of thinking about it needs to crumble the tower your foundation i don't know i need to figure out what this foundation is something is bugging me here with this world with most readings five of cups is something ah someone scarred you in the past which you're trying to prove a point here it is five of cups this is you this is not your person this is you so this is why you're not moving forward so this is two things. This is either you want that house, car, ten of pentacles, that true love, right? How your person to show up because of a past situation felt. Because that's not your person, trust me. They don't come towards you saying, let's get married, let's live together, do they? That's you. That's what I'm picking up with this card, right? You need to go within and say why you want that. And I tell you, because I've just done a, a, a reading to mission. And it's like, you know, I've done, not on this collective, the collective before, I don't know when I've done it, Monday maybe, and I said in my collective, it was about 45 minutes, maybe 50 minutes I do collective readings, and it took me about four seconds to say, like, oh, by the way, I'm engaged, right, how long does that take, right, and um, this is about, you want the, the house, the car, the family, all this and i'm like did you just hear what i said but that's what most underneath of every single one who listens to me wants their person getting engaged getting married kids house car whatever the point why i'm chosen is because does that matter to me the house the car doing a video with david saying that we're getting married and all that and we engage whatever no it matters to me that i just see david and spend that time with him 
This is what this Five of Cups is. Something in the past that you need to work on of why you want your version of love, how you feel it to be, because he's feeling it. And this is why you're manifesting someone who's the opposite of what you want, because they're showing you, go within, why do you fucking want that in the first place? These are two things you've manifested your person to put away. I don't feel there's a, even though this is my fuck off matey card, I don't feel there's a, I feel you've done it like, okay, you're over there, you're doing your thing, get on with it. That's how I feel, right? But you really want them, you know, to come back. Well, I don't even think you're thinking that. This is delusion. Seven of Cups. I said this, it's got Seven of Cups all over it. A delusion that they're going to come back with this offer. It's a delusion because that's what you want. Why do you want that? Even that's if it's from your upbringing of never seeing your parents doing it or you saw your parents arguing about I don't know why. Why is it? It's just a rooted belief. This could be even from television telling you when you're watching too many movies and they're saying to you, well, you know, that traditional life is, is, is great. Do you see what I mean? I don't know why. There's always different versions. But this is underneath is your choice of love. The lovers is a choice. And it's, you know, and it's like you're choosing to go down this road of wanting love a different way, which you're rejecting your person. Because, like I said, I just casually said, and I'm saying it here, right? I'm engaged, yes. But my main thing is that I just see David. And that's all it's ever been. If you go back to my videos in my playlist when I'm talking, I'm like, how to communicate with your person or anything like that. I'm sure I even mentioned way back years ago. I say... All I do is just chill and watch Netflix. What did we do yesterday? We just chilled and watched Netflix. That's all we love to do. There's nothing else. Like I said to him, maybe we'll go on holiday and chill and watch Netflix by a beach. That's it. I said to him, would you want to try that? And he said, yeah. But that's, that's it. The point is, you're missing the point. You want something. Your love is what... That person is your love. You want all the external. You must change that. You must. You are a light worker, star seed to show people stop going for the external. You must be here just focusing on what you love. And that's it. All right, I'm out. You want to know how to do that? Go to my website. There's tons of stuff on there. Speak to you later.